Hello friends, it's Divide by Zero. Welcome back to another episode of Engineer's Life. Uh, today we're actually going to go ahead, we're going to go back, we're going to retrace our steps, get back into the immersive engineering side of things, try and get some stuff done. Uh, and so I think what we're going to get done here is the assembler. Um, we've got it sort of going. I think we've got all the materials we need. So let's go grab our assembler. Uh, let's go ahead. I think up, oh, oh, that's where it was going to be placed, right? So we had to make, we still have to make some stuff. But I'm, I'm sure we have everything we need from a steel scaffolding perspective. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look. Um, we're going to need two redstone. You know, I'm honestly not sure exactly what we need to do it. Let's take a look. So we need to make a redstone engineering block. Alrighty, so that means circuit boards, right? So that's what we were after. We're after some insulating glass, which is just glass, iron dust, and these. So let's go make some of that. That we can do. So first step, insulating glass. I think we should make a good bit of it. As I recall, I think we've got cactus green. There we go. We're gonna need was that I think it was a glass or glass panes? I'm not sure. Take both just in case. Um, and we need some iron grit. I didn't use all my iron. I left some. That's awesome. Okay. So now if I come over, I should be able to make insulated glass. Alright, so I can make those, that's good. Alright, so we need insulated glass, we also, so copper plates, easy enough. Vacuum tubes, we need copper wire, nickel plates. So, and registering glass, and that. Um, so, glass, yeah, glass, redstone, nickel plate, copper wire. Um, do we have any of that laying around? Let's take a look. Nope, no copper wire. We have a circuit board. That's good. There's some coil wire there. Let's go get copper plates, though. Hopefully, we've got a set down here. Stuff we can make. Let's take a look. I think I've made some. All right, copper plates. Um, we also need some nickel plates, which I've also made. So I think we should be able to come on back up here, and we should be able to make something. There. What do we got? Uh, good, so we're going to go after this. We need uh, stained glass or just glass. Um, Alright, so we can put the, the panes back. Let's go ahead and do that. We do not need that, but we do need that. So, we're going to make so we have nickel plates, glass this and we need to put copper so actually we need um you know I, I think we can do that elsewhere so now we're good and now we need co copper oh, there's copper copper wire nickel plate Maybe, oh we don't need that yet we need glass nickel plate copper wire redstone and then copper wire is going to be, let's take uh, half, half of those, let's see, do we see A, no, why would we, oh, there they are, cool, nice, okay, so now we put copper wire and redstone, we make 30, um, that's probably more than we need, let's, Okay, well, I guess, uh, I guess we, <laughs> okay, um, I didn't know you could not do that, that's all right, okay, so now we can make a circuit board, we need insulating, not copper wire, sorry, insulating, uh, we need the vacuum tubes and copper plates, eight circuit boards, okay, so we've made some circuit boards, so now it's time, I think, maybe to make that redstone engineering block. Uh, 
copper plates. Plus, I need those. All right. Redstone engineer's block. Here we go. I should have enough to make more than that, shouldn't I? What am I missing? Oh, copper plate. I only have one copper plate because I used so many. Some copper here. Let's go ahead and make at least, let's make a few more just because. And I think we're going to need these as we go forward. I think they're some of the more standard ones. Um, hey, from the look of it, I'm also going to need more steel scaffold, but uh, alrighty. So here, let's uh, turn this off. Put some. Um, how much? Let's do 24 copper plates. Sounds good. Let that go. And if we wanted to do steel scaffold, we need. Uh, what is it? So if we go steel scaffolding is uh, steel over rods. So let's take this, come down here and say, let's make cool 16 rods. So there's like that. Nice. 18 steel scaffolding. I think I had some up, up ahead anyway. But if we come over here now, this is where we're going to go. Let's go ahead and start laying this out as that's go. What the heck? Did I? No, there it is. I guess it needs to be in my hotbar. Okay. So steel, steel, steel. Steel, steel, steel. Redstone engineer's block. One, two, and that I think is a light engineer's block. Let's go see. Nice, uh, it's 24. I've made those. So we can also, that should mean we can now make a few more of the redstone block so let's do that really quickly we can go and say redstone engineering block plus one two um, i'm gonna not make that just because i want to keep some of those components um, and now what we're gonna do is a light engineering block like that i'm pretty sure that's what it looks like which is copper plates, iron mechanical components, iron plates. Okay, so I need to make some iron mechanical components, which is two iron plates, one copper ingot. So I need some iron plates. Okay, they're all down. I should really move this workbench down here if I'm going to have stuff down here. It's probably a good idea. Um, ooh, do I have any more iron plates? That's a good question. Don't know. Uh, yeah, let's just make a lunch while we're at it. So that, that'll go. I'm pretty sure maybe I had some up there. Um, yeah, that's a light iron. I'm pretty sure that's a light one. Pretty sure. Alrighty, that's five, six. Let's take those. We're gonna join up and come back down here and get those other ones later. I think that's enough to get us started. Um, do we have any others up here in any of these? Uh, there's a seventh one. That's a heavy. So I'm pretty sure it's a light one that is what. Oh, iron mechanical components. Anyway, I've already got some. Um, so let's make some light ones. I have the iron mechanical components. Hey, look, I have more steel up here too, so I, I probably should have come up here first. All right, but I have the iron mechanical components. I want to make a light engineering block. Engineering block plus, I get two of them. I do it again. I need another iron plate, huh? Tisk tisk. Oh, more iron grit saved. I've saved enough iron grit to make the uh, all those pits parts, but in this case, I think 
what I've already got. So, is this the light block? Yes, yes it is. Alrighty, it looks like that is a light block. And now we need sheet metal. Six, six sheet metal. Let's go build that guy. Did I have any down here? I might have. I might have put it down here. Let's go take a look, shall we? I do. Nice. Don't have to run all the way back up there. Okay, dokie. So now it's one, two, three, four, five. Whoops. Five, six. Um. Okay. And then I need to. We need two of the, what was I looking at there? Conveyor belts. Which I didn't see. I have 31 right there. All right. Probably going to need more of those, but and why would we not put them where I can use them? Yeah, and the question is, is that the end of it, or is there stuff that goes on top? And I'm not sure the answer to that. One. Two. Okay, there's a third row. And it looks like that is um, this, that, that. Whoops. And that. And then six of these. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Okay, and then I need to click something probably with my engineer's hammer, which I'm going to assume is up top. So I'm going to dump a bunch of this stuff back in here. Um, since I just don't want to be carrying it around. Awesome. What else was there? Uh, uh, this guy. I don't need you anymore. Have engineer's block. That. All right, we cleaned it out. Let's go get our engineer's hammer. And then I think I think we're gonna be good. Wait, I saw one. I saw totally saw one. All right. Um, eat. Sleep. Yeah. I'm excited, and then I, I, I don't know um, how they work, but I am excited at the prospect, at least, of figuring it out. I'm probably going to need to figure out where power, uh, have to run some more power. I don't, yeah, I'm pretty low on the power, all things considered. That one? No. Okay, I guess that's that way. Figured it out. Alright, so that's redstone signal. Is the power up on top? So this is where things come out. Is that where the power goes? No, I think that's blue and, and red to tell you in and out. Um, so... One... Oh, that's where the power goes. Okay, cool. Nice. See, it's telling you direction, so I've already I've got it running the wrong way. So you can already tell that I built it kind of the wrong way. But that's pretty cool. All right, so we need some wire. I probably want to take a relay from there over and build another like. You know, that's a little too far away. I don't think I'm going to be able to get... 
I don't think I'll be able to get um, all the way up there. I don't think. I'm not even sure how many of these I have. Um, so we should take a look and just see if we can get some power over to it. And then I, I mean, honestly, I've never used it. So the wire connectors, I know I'm going to need at least. I definitely need the one. Definitely gonna need at least two of those. Definitely going to need that. Probably that. Um, probably that. All right. So let's go with that. Let's go with these items. Let's see where we're at. Because I'm probably going to want to go a relay from there. Probably build over to, I don't know, like a... Uh, I probably want to do a relay over here somewhere, wouldn't we? Probably. I think so. That probably makes sense. Have a shovel. Let's use it to get me some dirt to get up higher. Because I don't I'm getting a little, you know, annoyed. So we'll just go. Like that. Okay. All right. So we got a bunch of this. Which means we can come up here. We can come back off here. We can put this down. Okay, I can now think of like this, like this. Pop up here. I can say if I go like I kind of want to go like um I'm not entirely sure how I want that to go. So if I take you and say nope, you rotate like that. I'm not sure about that. That's weird. Probably use the axe probably faster. It's wood, right? Okay, so if I put you on the lower side, it'll be upside. That's the way I want to go. Okay, so now I can engineers block you. So you look like that. Okay, let's go down one. Or two. Maybe and put the relay there. Relay. It's gonna go here. Nice. You can put the. Can I receive? Can I hit that from here? I may not be able to. If I go and grab you. Yep. There we go. And now, if I take my wire take you to you and you let's go see how it's gonna work over to you so that's too far away Huh. Well, that's annoying. So we need the relays to be more regular than that, I guess. Which means I guess I need to put one up here. But I don't have another relay. But if I did, what I would do would be this. If I did. Okay, I need a relay and a mount. might need another bit of wire actually so that's not a connector we need one more relay do I even want a mount yeah probably we'll take one mount I think from there will be good okay so our assembler is 
built at least. We are still going to have to figure out this whole automation thing, but we're having a good time. Let's come on up. A little bit higher here. I'm going to say right here. Okay, I'm going to go like this. And I think what I'll do is put the, whoops, not ready yet. I need you and you. Nice, that's perfect actually. That is exactly what I wanted. Four, cool. So now I can put the relay there. Now I can take the wire from here run it hmm. not quite to you nice then what I'm thinking is, if I cut this one, I can run from, uh, now what I'll do, I'm going to attack with it, it's okay, I can just go from there, over to you, and that should be power. Okay. Now, I should be able to come on and say, break, 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 break. That's all right. And then, same over here. Oops. That was not what I intended. That happens. I get to rebuild all this. Joy. Yeesh. Yeah, that happens, doesn't it? Yeah, the old thing, try and use the whatever, it took completely the wrong stuff. That's frustrating, right? But, that's okay. We're learning. We're still learning. Still getting through it. I don't really care about all the way under, right? I really only care about the front of it, so that's alright. Nice. Whoops. You, sir, need to go. Should probably upgrade my sapphire shovel right now. Um, oh, there's that's why I couldn't place it there. That's why that happened. We're just going to go ahead and pull this up a little tiny bit. Alright. I'll fix the rest of it later when, um,. When you all aren't watching, no reason to waste all that time. Although I do not like this pod, though I have no problem getting rid of that. Okay, um, but with that, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these anyway because I just don't like. I don't want to have this tower here in this way. I'll get rid of those last bits as soon as um, we want. But there we go. And I'm gonna get rid of them now. They're in the way. I could almost get rid of that if I wanted, but I don't mind it. I might actually build a uh, wood going up kind of like I did for that one here. But, so we should have power, is I think the point here. So if I come over and right click on it, uh, so I can make recipes. It's got power, look at that, that's good. Um, so then what I just need to do is figure out how to tell it to do things. I also think I need fluid, right? So if I got it fluid, I need to make a, a fluid machine. Maybe over here. So if I put a fluid tank here, I could run the fluid in underneath. Because um, then I could basically automate the making of um, planks. I'm just curious. Let's see if we can get that running. That'll be kind of this episode. If we can get 
automated assembler driven creosote oil. That would be super. Um, so in order to do that, you know, for right now, what I'm going to do is make a silo, or a, not a silo, but a, one of those. I think I've got enough of this. I have enough treated wood fence. I think this is enough. This might be, I might be just, just a hair short. What I'll do is I'm going to come over here. Um, I want it to be on the same level as that, so for the flow out. So I'm going to go right here. These three by three. Looks good to me. One, two, three, four. Three by three. Go here. And that's one, two, three. Nice. Very nice. I'm pretty sure it's one more because it's going to be four tall. So I'm pretty sure I do not have enough. Because now I'm on the same level as that guy, right? So it's three deep here. Yep. One, two, three up on the fourth level. I need, so I need one, two, three, four. So I need actually eight more. Pretty easy to tell. Then I get back up there. Um, so do I have the iron laying around up down here? The answer does not appear to be yes. So do I have enough iron plate up here? Let's make sheet metal. And the answer does not appear to be yes. Not up here either. So I need to make iron plate, which means I need iron. There's only 17 in there. It looks like I am almost back to a shortage again, again. I mean, iron is just a perpetual problem. And I, well, I just made a bunch too, so hopefully, hopefully we're okay. Now I hopefully have a couple of stacks left. We've got plenty of steel at the moment. Which is good, and this is still running actually. Six more blocks of steel there, so that's good. Um, so, what I want to do here is let's go ahead and turn this off. Dump the I have iron plates right there. Um, I have 31 on me, so foolish. There we go, I've laced on that. So, I got all those back, um, so I didn't waste them all. I have 34 if I go like this. One, two, three, four. I get four. I need eight. Nice. Now I need to get up on there. Nice. Let's make it. Dope. Okay. And now what I need is you to get. No, really? Didn't turn that back on. There. Nice. Okay. Okay. Very good. So now, if I come over here and say, engineers hammer you, hopefully we get what we're looking for. And we do. Which is fantastic. Doesn't need anything except for more um, you know we should have plenty of piping I don't know that I can pipe from there all the way over to you so what I might do is go ahead and cheat and use some of those um, just to fill it so we can test it I don't I think that you don't need power or a fluid pump to get fluid out so what I'm going to do is this. We're going to make an open block. Um, we're just going to make a tank so we can get um, one. That was how much? Uh, enough. Uh, we'll get some obsidian. Let's go ahead and make a few. Okay, let's go ahead and make a few of these. So we want to go one, 
two, three, four. I think you make two when you do that. So actually, I think we only need to do it once. Okay. Yep. Good enough. Come on over here. Put stuff away. Very good. All right. We are going to need some buckets. I don't know where all my buckets are. I've got this one, which I can dump some water out of. Oh, there's five more. Nice. Okay. So let's go get some creosote oil to pump to put in there. And then, actually, I, I'm pretty sure that this is where the uh, the fluid pipes are. I made uh, several of them. Yep, ten. Which should be enough for what we need. So, oops. Okay. Alrighty. So let's come on over here. Let's go ahead and put our tanks down. Okay, now what I'm going to do, I'm pretty sure I can't actually take it from there and put it in. Pretty sure I need to go like this and just say five and then go one. Pretty sure it's going to need to look like this. Two, four, five. And then what I kind of want to do is come over here. I don't know, is there a place with a hole? Just a little hole? It's not going to hurt anything. Yep, like right there, for example. Perfect. You can tell there's a little bit of a shortage of grease oil up in there. Awesome. So, I mean, this is already enough, but I'm, I'm already doing it. So, I'm just going to go ahead and just hope for the last one. Alright, that's good enough. For the game we're playing, that's good enough. Okay. Let's take some of this creosote oil over. We'll go ahead and load this one up a little bit. Then we're going to end up moving all of that, that part over here so we can start doing it from over here. And what we're going to do is, let's go ahead and put these down. I don't know. Same-ish spot. We'll put them right over here. Right there. Perfect. You guys. Okay. guess if you stack them, that doesn't work that way. So that's okay. We'll go one. Two. Two, three, four, five, six. Just want to get some in. We're not going to finish this right now, but I do want to make sure that I've got this. I got to take one bucket, I think. So if I go like this, I'm just curious. If I go one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven. So those are connected. So I come over and talk to you. Um, why are you? Why is there nothing flowing? I feel like it should be. I feel like that's the input. Oh, maybe doesn't know that it wants it. So if I go creosote oil, and now what I need is wood, right? So I need to make sure I get wood planks, I guess. So I would need a sawmill. Um, I'm just gonna... Huh. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That's... Um... I'm not entirely sure, but here, I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take these. I'm gonna take some of... How much do I have? I think the wood that I had been chopping is likely over here. So let's come over here and grab it. I think that's the dark wood that we're going to have the most of, generally speaking. Is this dark dark oak wood planks? I think it's all, I think it's all dark oak. All right, let's take it. Let's go see. 
Now what I don't like is that it's not it's kind of not showing me that it's got fluid. It's I don't know. It's, it's really weird. Okay, so if I go like this. So yep, making that. I don't want to clear it. Treated wood planks. Yep. Okay, so I have power. I'm not sure what that is. So if I come here and say put these guys down, going that way, going that way, All right, going that way. Going that way, just for grins, right? So if I said, boink. So that goes in. So if I come over here and talk to you, it has that. How come? Okay, that works. How, how, how do you get the fluid to go in? Like, because there's fluid on there, in here. Well, just goes to show, I apparently don't know how that works yet. Does it, I mean, I don't think it needs to have stuff going in at the top. It shouldn't need to have much more in it. Right, I mean, like, it, it should just work. Oh, you know what? Do I have to? Do I have to? I'm just curious. This is a good question. If I go take my engineer's hammer, where is it? Do I have to set this as now? No. It should know. Can I tell if there's any fluid in it? I don't understand. All right, well, it just comes back to say, right? I, I don't understand. And um, I'm going to have to Google that one. So, I mean, it looks like we have it working. It is auto assemble. Uh, did I pick those up because I have the whatever on? No. Okay, so I, I fed it things. Oh, okay, so it's got them. They're here. Um, I guess I could do it with buckets. You know, I just I don't un I don't know I don't understand. Uh, I go like this. I say Q. I throw you in there and you go in. Up, okay. oh, made it. It made it, and that gives me the bucket back. So, okay. Um, I mean, if I, I'm, does it work? I mean, I don't think it's going to work if I do this. If I take that, I come up and say, you go. No. Well. No, no, no. I didn't want you to do that. Maybe some chests, which I totally didn't want. That doesn't work. Okay. So we need to come here. That that was a failure. That was my failure. So I just made chests where I didn't want chests. Totally only um Oh, okay. So it'll use that tank if I throw it in, apparently. So if I did this. So if I take you. If I throw you in here. And then if I go and th grab more. Dark oak planks, I'm just curious. If I go throw you over there. We are trying to figure out this assembly. I mean, I'm, I am new with this game. That is for sure. So if I do this, just want to see 
it's churning them out. It stops. I guess it's 64. But yep, it's churning them out. Okay, so I don't have anything on the output side, right? Which is probably why it's not working. So I should probably put a, well, I have, I have these. So if I make a crate, it might put them in the crate. So if I take this, I'll put you here. It still has 5,500. I, mean, I, I, I don't know why it's not getting any of the fluid. I'm going to go make more. I'm going to go make a little bit more. Um, oh, I don't have any more dark. Huh. Alright, I'm going to go with oak for now. I'm going to go in and re. I have to redo the recipe here. Either that or I could go like this. I could come here and and say okay that okay hmm don't know all right but now if I came up here and said Q let's throw these in All right, that's cool. I'm not sure if it. I'm just curious. So if I do this, if I just throw in these, I'm just curious. So does it just auto sub? It does. It will use any planks. That's fantastic. So I don't have to do this. I can clear this recipe, which is good. It is, however, not auto evacuating things here. Um, at least not yet. So what I should probably do is this. There you go. So now it is. Now if I come like this, hit that with the engineer's hammer. So it's up. There we go. And now, if I put you here, now I'm betting. Well, I don't know why you're not exporting. But, if I go throw the rest of these planks on, it did some. Nope, didn't do any. Okay. So if I go throw these on, say, Used it, threw it down. They did not get put in. Um, so that is probably because of my failure here. I probably need to do this. And now put that in down here. But that was all of them, right? So I don't actually have any more. <laughs> I don't actually have another way to test it. I think we're close. Alright, so things should go in there now. So right if I, I, mean, I shouldn't, but if I throw you down, okay, treated with blank button there. Okay, so I'm going to go try one more time. These are all treated. I want to go get one non-treated spruce wood planks. Let's go throw spruce wood planks on there, see if that converts them and throws them in. So we're going to go spruce wood planks, creosote oil, whoops, and spruce wood planks. Okay, it didn't make anything because it, or, 
Well, it no, it made some. And so if I come here and say put you in here. What did it? I think it made some more. It did, sort of. Alright, so it kind of sort of works. Um, I, gotta, I gotta tell you, I mean, like, I, I don't understand how it works exactly. But, um, but okay. Totally kind of works. Alright, well, with that, though, I think, um, oops, with this guy, so we've got this set up. We need to figure out why fluid is not pumping through that pipe, but. Uh, we do have an auto manufacturing plantish thing. I don't know that we need it for any particular reason, but it looks cool. So thanks for watching. Hello, hello. I'm back really, really fast. I think I figured it out. I think because it's the same mistake I make all the time. So let's see if we can fix it real quick. By running back home, let's go see if we can get this creosote oil into the assembler simply by grabbing a lever if this is it i'm gonna be really really annoyed at myself adding a lever let's come on back i'm gonna put it right there all right got a lever all right look no creosote oil boink creosote oil yeah, figures. And now it's just automatically making me those while I have it. And that is it. So, hey, why does that look funky? That's kind of annoying. Nah, whatever. In any event, look at that. Full creosote oil. So the only other thing I gotta do is basically stop what's going on over there, transfer everything from that tank into this tank. Which is going to take a lot of pipe. But, I'll do that off camera. So what I'm going to do, just to give you guys a heads up. This works. So we are golden over here, to the extent. Um, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to run uh, from this guy. All the way over to that guy. Um, which means I have to make a lot of fluid pipe. And then I'm going to just destroy this and take it all over there with me. Um, and then I'm going to move all this. So, because we're, we're still making away. We're still working away. I don't know how much is in all this. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, I, I guess I could... could yeah. Oh! Hello, bad guy. Alright. Hey, let my dogs attack you. Thank you, dogs. Um, cool. Yeah, anyway, so we got that all working. Come on, it's down there. So, uh, so that's what I'm going to do. Is I'm going to pipe it from here all the way over there. Um, at least so. Yeah, 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 so we can have that. Um, but I wanted to, you know, come back and, and show you that we got it working. It's full. We can do it. i got to get the rest of that out into here also since there's no more fluid in there, but we're full up over here, so we can make it by just throwing stuff on here. What we probably will need to do is to make a sawmill? Sawmill? Survivalist? I think if I take... How do I make planks? So yeah, if I want to make an oak wood plank, um, do it with a saw chopping block so survivalist i think i think i can do it with this saw mill oh he just pushed me i thought somebody attacked me but my dog just pushed me he wanted to say hi so if i make this survivalist saw mill which is not hard steel coke bricks whatever um Okay. Yeah, I think it does the same thing. What I don't know is whether or not the outputs 
can be dumped directly on. Yeah, so if you put this on. Yeah, I don't know. You, you know, I, I've, I've never used it. With a vi oh yeah, that's like that's ways off, way off. Chainsaws, framing saws, wow, all kinds of stuff. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I might I might make this just to see how it how it works. But we'll do that in another episode. In any event, we we came back, we got this working. That's pretty cool. It's raining, I know. That's annoying, but we at least got that working. It took like ever. Like always, when it's not working and you're like, why is it not working? The answer is lever. Cheers.